happy Easter, everyone. I've been joking saying happy chocolate bunny day because we all know what Easter is about, but somehow they turned it into a chocolate bunny day instead of uh, the resurrection day. Anyway, my wife and I are just sitting here going over some memories and uh, how we have a lot of good trucking memories, but we also have a lot of really good motorcycle memories and we were just remembering one we were looking for me, my wife, and how many other people? A good five or six, seven yeah. other people on motorcycles. We were in, uh, not, where were we? Knoxville? Knoxville yeah. yeah. And we, we had rode the Dragon, and we rode all around. And we uh, were staying at a campground there. We spent a whole week. And we all decided we were going to go to Ruby Falls down in Chattanooga. Not a far drive. And uh, we all drove down there, and it was not really easy to find it. So one of the guys in our group goes into this, a restaurant or something, wasn't it? Well, it was a gas station, but we had gotten off the interstate because a certain member of our party could not do internet, internet, uh, internet interstate speeds because she was scared. And that would not be me. That wasn't me. And um, so we were taking the back roads to Chattanooga. And uh, so a friend of ours went in to ask what was the quickest way to get to Chattanooga. And they said, where are you going? And he said, Ruby Tuesdays. And they said, I don't think there's a Ruby Tuesdays in Chattanooga. We were going to Ruby Falls and we could not make him Remember, it was Ruby Falls and not Ruby Tuesdays. Yeah, all through the whole day, he called yeah. Ruby Falls. He called it Ruby Tuesdays. Where are we going? We're going to Ruby Tuesdays. No, Terry, we're going to Ruby Falls. Oh, that's right, Ruby Falls. Yeah. So even when he went and asked for directions, he asked, how do you, how do you get to Ruby Tuesday? I ain't never heard of it. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. And then we, we get there and we get down into Falls. <clears throat> when we come back out. Well, you left out a funny part. What did I leave out? We actually were on the elevator with them to go down, and they're oh. very gassy people. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Apparently, in some cultures, farting out loud is uh, okay. acceptable, perfectly yeah. normal. <laughs> and we were, we were at Ruby Falls, and to get down into this huge cavern, you go down this long elevator. It takes about a minute and a half. And we we're and in... Huh? Not long enough to panic. Long, yeah, long enough to panic. My wife and I both are claustrophobic. Anyway, so we get in this elevator with these people. They're in. They're from India. I don't know what part of India. They're very nice people, and they're all dressed in really colorful clothes that we don't see here, and I don't even know what to call them. And uh, about halfway down. <laughs> About halfway down, the elder woman lets out this huge fart. And everybody in this elevator, we're looking at each other like, okay, maybe that's okay where they're coming from. So for half the trip down in this elevator, we're breathing in this lady's really stinky uh, curry fart. <laughs> anyway, uh it was hard. They're very friendly and very nice people. It was just uh, uh, funny because it was such a different culture than ours. Anyway, we're all done with the tour and we come out. And now this same family is standing near uh, my motorcycle. And they were taking pictures of it and all that. And I went over there to my motorcycle. And I guess they thought maybe I was going to shoo them away or something. But I told him, I said, hey, have a seat. You can sit on it and take pictures. It won't fall over. Anyway, I, I, it was just really nice seeing. Uh, well, the, they sat on it, and they it looked like people sitting on a big truck because they were very tiny. They were very small people. I they felt were. like um, Anna's eye was just gigantic. I felt like a monster person. Yeah, and there. that was a good memory. And then my wife said, that she remembers more of the story that they were there for a wedding and uh then a monk. a monk there was this monk that was there and i don't know where he was from what country he was from India. but he was from 
And was he? He was dressed in monk clothing, and uh, my, my, you know, we don't see monks here. I mean, shaved head, you know, Asian features, and uh, it was just pretty cool. Anyway, my wife says, uh, "Would you mind if I took a picture of you?" And you know, she hey, stood next to him. And yeah, do you have that picture? I do. And he said, "I, I believe that would be okay." And I. I felt like a huge person. He was very small, yeah. tiny, tiny, real tiny. If I can find that picture, I'll see if I can roll it into this video. Anyway, we're just sitting here thinking about, you know, I'll be 61 in a few days. My wife is, how old are you? I will be 67. 67. And uh, we really have had some truly, we've had a tough life, you know, we have, and we lived a rough life in our early years. So, uh, but by God, we got some really good memories, interesting memories, and I would not change a thing, not change a thing. Uh, what we've done has led us to where we are, and we're sitting on our front porch reminiscing about some of the truly interesting people we've met and fantastic places we've been and and, uh, you know, it has been a hard life, and we've both suffered a lot uh, because of our life. But it's been a great life. I mean, it wouldn't change a thing, and it's nice I'm to sit here. Blessed. I'm truly blessed. I'm blessed more than I will ever deserve. Yeah, we're lucky to have the health that we do have uh, and uh, the memories. My God, we've lived two or three lifetimes in just our 60 years. Anyway, if I can, if my wife can find that picture, I'll see if I can include it. Okay, my wife found some pictures. This is her on her uh, road liner. And here's that monk. And that was uh, at Ruby Falls. Here he is with the sandals. <laughs> good times, good times. Here's her bike again. That bike was massive. Oh, but it was fun. I loved that bike. 